Stein. Yeah, I just wanted to jump in on that point. I mean, what can Congress do legislatively? What kind of? I, I'm, I, I get that they're going to look into it. I get that they'll hold hearings on this, bring witnesses in. But that seems to be the response to every VA scandal, which is you hold hearings, you talk to people, and then nothing gets done. So what practical steps can Congress actually make? What type of legislation would you suggest that they consider? Uh, do they create their own select committee to look into something like yeah, this? We, we've supported a VA Accountability Act that, that's been put forward by Speaker Boehner that would empower the VA to actually fire people, because it's really hard to do right now. That's just one piece of this. We've also got a comprehensive piece of suicide prevention legislation, the SAVE Act, sponsored by Senator Walsh, the only Iraq vet in the Senate. That's got to go through too. So after they get done, you know, banging on their chest in front of this hearing on Thursday, they've got to move legislation through. They can actually help no matter what happens to Shizeki. Well, let's, I'll tell you, let's get uh, Jeff Miller to come on the show. Yeah. And we'll talk about it. Because yeah. he is he is fighting on well, the House well, side. Well, try to get yeah. the secretary on. Yes, yes. And I don't think you will, which is another part of the problem. He has not been held publicly accountable until recently. This scandal went on for days before he did a single interview. What other cabinet-level secretary could have this kind of a scandal and essentially hide from the public and hide from the media for this long? We had uh, Jim